Matthew. When I was a little girl, I didn't know what I wanted to be when I grew up, but I knew two things for sure. I wanted to be a mom, and I wanted to be a wife. You walked into my life out of what felt like thin air. I can remember so vividly the first time I truly noticed you. It caught me by surprise because I had met you a couple days earlier. But suddenly I was staring at you thinking, huh, there's something different about him. I didn't know what it was then, but I was right, and I do now. Kylie, when I first met you on that wild trip to Pisa, I couldn't keep my eyes off you. Your dance moves, your undeniable beauty, your independence, and your willingness to just have a good time drew me towards you. I've always been so confident, but I couldn't help but be nervous around you. When I told you not to visit later, I couldn't sleep, and I thought I had made the worst mistake of my life. I knew that I needed you in my life, and from this day forward, my heart is entirely yours. Always do your best to be patient with each other. You will be faced with many ups and downs. Love each other unconditionally. I'm a witness to the hard work it will take to get through the many highs and lows in life and in marriage. I ask everyone to raise their glass and toast Mr. and Mrs. Hart. Cheers. You are my everything, and my final promise to you is to be the best husband, partner, lover, future father I can be for you. I love you so much. I stand here before you today, ready to start the biggest adventure of our lives together as one. And in that adventure, I promise to laugh with you, cry with you, and grow with you. And lastly, I promise to never forget to have fun with you. By the power vested in me and by the love of God and all those who are here to witness their love, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Matthew, you may kiss your bride.